think we're we're locked in a little bit more uh, pitching and defense wise. I, I think uh, you know year over year feeling that way. Uh, I think that's been a, a big strength of the club and, and an area of consistency for us. I think you know going in through last year I think offensively at this moment in time going through July and August we had had sort of a little bit of a downturn offensively as well and then you know things happened in September end of August and September that really sort of catapulted us to the end and and you know we're hoping to do some of those same things and I think things are kind of coming together as a group we've sort of put the team together as of the trading deadline I think there's some new faces new roles from bullpen guys to some of our position players um, and you know when those things all come together we feel pretty good about this team I we think you know it's solid all the way around there's there's a lot of really good pieces to it there's a lot of uh, places where we're excelling and we're trying to improve upon the ways that we're not what things do you think will contribute to the offense you know clicking maybe a little bit more than it has I know Tori obviously juggled the lineup I'm sure you were in, involved in some of that as well I mean how involved are you in those conversations with getting the most out of the offense and the players of course that you brought in here yeah I, we, we do that every day we're having those daily conversations whether it's lineup construction or it's it's not so much who's in the lineup that Tori obviously does that on a daily basis but we we fire a lot of questions at him every day you know about different types of things and there's some things that he takes and he and, you know employs some things he's like no nah, I don't think I'm gonna do that right now and that's not the best fit for us and um, you know that's our job to back off from there uh, but we, we try to be a sounding board and bring some of those things to light I think as a whole we do a lot of things really well I think we're getting on base at a better clip than we were last year I think we have a lot of really good innings like you saw last night in the first inning I think carrying that through nine innings is something that that we're gonna want to see done more consistently as we move through the latter part of the season as you get into September and you're facing teams with unknown bullpens because the bullpens will get bigger with expansion um, we need to do a better job in those areas but we're focused on those things the players are focused on those things and you know everybody has room for improvement every team out there even the, the teams that we're playing that's just one of those things that we're gonna focus on mention the pitching and defense and the starting pitching right now and seeing the way you know clay has pitched um, what Granky and Pat Patrick continue to do uh, how good do you feel about this group and the way that they're going to perform because baseball you know everything changes but they've been so consistent and obviously you hope that stays that way yeah the the, our, the I think the bedrock of our team has been the pitching and the defense and, and it kind of was going into the offseason and into into the early parts of the season I think that if you can control those things effectively you can control the pace a lot of the games um, you can pitching and defense you can bring out there every single day because you can the pitching Pitcher controls the baseball, obviously, and then defensively we can back that up. And then, like I said, the, and, and every team does. The offense goes through; it sort of fits and starts a little bit. But we'd like to see that continue to improve, um, just from an at bat to an at bat standpoint, for nine straight innings, and be able to do that night after night after night. Um, not a possible task over 162 games, but something that we can do, I think, in larger stretches than we are. But I think we're going to always have been built on our pitching and defense, and I wouldn't expect that to change. We've loaded up the bullpen with a number of different types of arms. Our Archie Bradley, though, has been, you know, a guy you've relied on heavily to face those toughest hitters in the late innings. When you look at his struggles of late, is there concern or is it just sort of one of those patches right now that everyone kind of goes through? Yeah, that's how I look at it. I mean, this guy's been so good for so long. He's been our best reliever for two years. He's going to continue to be. We're going to continue to rely on him um, in every critical situation as we should. Uh, he's he's exceptional at what he does. And, you know, <laughs> when you're playing in one-run games, uh, the, the uh, every reliever is going to get clipped every now and again and you know I think when a when that happens to a late inning reliever with it's happened to Boxberger a couple times when when you're in one or two run games and you make one bad pitch it can't define exactly what we're trying to do with the bullpen you know those things that's baseball it happens to every team it happens to every play every relief pitcher um, you know I think what we can do proactively is build a little bit more of a cushion there in those situations again going back to the offensive consistency through the game to create three four run leads so when you give up a solo shot it, it's just that um, I think that's an area that we're continuing to focus on.